Hello, good afternoon. My name is Bimbo and welcome to our channel once again. Now, are you in that category of somebody that is thinking of how to change career to the tech space? You are looking for an opportunity to be able to train yourself in the tech space. And if possible, use that opportunity to be able to relocate yourself and your family out of your current country. Yes, I have an exciting news for you. Now, especially if you are considering opportunity in the tech space the it space cyber security data analysis ui ui or ux design yes i mean artificial intelligence among all the it related skills that you have been you know dreaming or thinking about acquiring for yourself or switching a career into i have another if important and exciting opportunity to share for you and the beauty of it is that it is a vocational opportunity to austria yes you heard me right a vocational opportunity to austria where they will teach you within uh, 12 to 18 months extensively on different IT related skills such, such as UX design, data analytics, uh, cyber security, project management, website design, I mean artificial intelligence, among other IT related skills of your choosing. So they have quite a number of them. I'll be showing you the details about these uh, 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 courses of vocational opportunities that are taught in Austria in this school. Yes, I'll be showing them to you shortly. And another thing is this there is no tuition fee required yes you re you heard me right there is no tuition fee there is no qualification required what they only require that you have is your enthusiasm to be able to learn your interest to be able to learn the it related skills of your choosing yes another thing is this you can move with your family once you are accepted in this school they have about three phase of applications or admissions for this september uh, or i mean for this year intake and i'll be showing to you step by step process to be able to get admitted into the uh, uh into the admission intake this the september intake this year so i'll be showing them to you and all i mean which means because if they don't ask ask you to pay school fees you'll be wondering how do i in show proof of funds do i need to show proof of funds yes because your living expenses is what you need to cater for because in vienna where the school is i mean and by the way the name of the school is called 42 vienna yes 42 vienna and it is in vienna which is in austria so i'll be showing to you the details about the school there is no application fee there's no tuition fee all you just have to bother about is your living expenses for the 12 to 18 month of intensive training on it related skill of your choosing yes so they expect that you be physically present by 2nd of september 2024 when the training will start i mean start exclusively for all their uh, applicants so another thing is this if you are an international applicant you just need to be able to take care of your living expenses and from what i've seen on their platform and from their alumnus some people are doing this training and they are working part-time yes they are working full-time might not be possible because of the requirement of the training but some are doing it part-time and some are doing it uh, and some are doing it part-time to be able to take care of themselves and their living expenses in vienna so i'll be showing to you details about this application procedure all that is required the proof of funds and some international applicants all that you have to bother about should not be more than uh, uh, 3 million to 4 million max 5 million living expenses in your account should be able to get you the visa to go to Austria in September of this year okay so I'll be showing to you the details about the application procedure and mind you the third phase of the application procedure will require that you be physically present in Vienna by july of this year because it there is a four weeks intensive training where they'll be able to make their final decision about the uh, about the about the selection of their candidate so it is after the four weeks of intensive training and you know evaluations of your of yourself and your interest in the program that is when they will be able to decide whether you are good to go to be able to join their cohort by 2nd of september 
2024. So this is an opportunity that you cannot afford to miss. And if you are just seeing us for the first time, this is Japa with your days. On this channel, we discuss opportunities to Portugal, to Austria, and other beautiful European countries where we believe that uh, you are going to have a beautiful relocation experience. So if you're just seeing us for the first time, like and subscribe to this channel so that by the time we drop information and opportunities like this, you will be the first person to get notification. So if you are interested in such kind of opportunities to switch career to the IT, I mean, to switch career to the uh, IT, IT field or, you know, to learn data analytics, cyber security, artificial intelligence and all other IT related skills of your choosing, this is an opportunity for you that you cannot afford to miss. Watch this video to the end while I show you the steps and every other thing that is required for you to be able to apply for this vocational opportunity to Vienna. So like I said, the name of the school is called 42 Vienna. Yes, as you can see it here, 42 Vienna. That is the name of the vocational institution in Vienna. 42 Vienna is the name of the school. Now, and this is the career path. Let me first of all show you the IT related skills that you can hope to achieve when you study with them. So, and uh, yeah, if, if, I mean, under infrastructure management, you can, you know, you can become a network architect, a network administrator. If you train on the software developer or you take interest under a software development uh, uh, skill, you can become a mobile app developer, game developer, website developer. Or if you take uh, interest in creative industries, you can become a UI or UX designer. Then as an in, in the entrepreneurship space, you can become a project manager, data analyst, CTO, or founder. So they have various, um, I mean, uh, IT related skills that they, you know, that they teach to their student in which at the end of the day, you can now tailor your own interest or your own skills to a certain stage, whether you want to become a data analyst, a cybersecurity, a, 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 a UX designer, a web developer. So at the end of the day, before the end of the intensive course, or even during the training, that is when you would have discovered yourself and where your interests lie mostly. That is where you'll be able to build your career in. So those are the, I mean, these are the jobs that the uh, that you can at the end of the day after the training that you can develop yourself into and look to build a career in. Now, so another thing is this, like I said, they do not. Um, I mean, there is no tuition fee. So you see here, tuition fee at forty two, at forty two Vienna, there are no hidden application fee, no hidden registration fee, no hardware fees, nothing, nothing during or at the end of the training course. Yes, nothing like that. Okay. So and there is no nothing like a uh, uh, There is nothing like a um, uh, qualification. No qualification is required. Nothing like that is required. In fact, they said no prior experience in coding is required. All that is required for you is just to have the interest and the enthusiasm to be able to uh, uh, to be able to want to take a training in the IT or tech related space so that their own is just for you, them to be able to help you discover yourself and tailor your skills to one areas of of, of 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 training so that at the end of the day you can either become a data analyst uh, a cyber security uh, uh, or they train you in the ux designing stage project management stage or they train you to be a web developer depending on what your area of interest is during or in the middle of the training that is when you will be able to discover where your training or your interests lie particularly the most so yes so that is that for the um, tuition fee and all of that thing. And of course, you will, uh, of course, you will eventually need visa to be able to, um, um, I mean, apply for this course. Now, let me quickly show you how to apply. Yes, how to apply. The first is to register at this website here. Yeah? I will show you the details to you. The first is to register at this website. Now, when you register, they will immediately require that you take a two hours online logic games. Yes, the idea of these online logic games is just for them to be able to 
uh, uh, check your logic reasoning, uh, aptitude reasoning, quantitative reasoning, and just to be able to think about, I mean, and just to be able to assess or evaluate your thinking capacity, I mean, particularly those skills, the logic reasoning skills, quantitative reasoning skills, and all other skills that are required from a, a UX designer, a data analyst, the way a, a data analyst or IT related skills, some of the basic skills that are, uh, that are essential uh, uh, for a, a data analyst among other related skills in the IT space that I require. Some of the, some of the basic things are what the, these games will want to test. So you, after you register, they will require that you take a two hours online logic games, then, if you pass this online logic game, then there is what is called introduction meeting, where they would like to meet with you. Um, I mean, introduce the campus to you, the curriculum, the campuses. And um, by the way, they have about, I mean, I think they have about uh, 54 campuses and they are located in 31 countries. So which means by the time you want to start your um, um, internship. The, another thing that I forgot to mention at the introduction of the video is something called paid internship for about four to six months. There is a paid internship and based on their statistics and from their alumnus that I've read on their website, during your internship, 80% of their students get recruited during internship, 80%. So that is a very, I mean, that is a good deal during internship. The program is for 12 to 18 months and during internship of, of about four to six months where they will assign you to and don't forget that it is this program is not only uh does not only restrict you to vienna where their campus is like i showed to you they have campus in about uh 54 uh con i mean sorry they have uh, 54 campuses and in 31 countries so which means your internship can be in france can be in italy can be in belgium can be in different European countries. So they have 31 European countries that they have campuses in. So it, uh, your internship does not necessarily have to be in uh, in Austria or in Vienna. So it can be in any country, but they are the one that will be able to help you to give you an internship placement. And they have different industry partners. I will show that to you as well. Now, so now, during the introduction meeting, the introduction meeting is going to last for an, an hour. And in this meeting, uh, the, 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 the management team of the 42 Vienna are going to be able to introduce themselves, the details about the course, what is expected from them, what is expected from you, and all other information are going to be passed across to you. So this meeting is going to last for about an hour. That is the second phase of the application procedure. Now, the third phase of the application procedure, if uh, I, I mean, if during the meeting you are able to convince them and everything goes as planned, there is the third phase that is called the pacing phase of the application procedure. And this phase is called the pacing is a four weeks immersive training boot camp on campus in Vienna. So you can do this online. The, the first two phases can be done online. The third phase is on campus and they have about two phases. I think one phase is in June, one phase is in July. Now, I, I mean, I will get there shortly. So. The pacing phase is a boot camp where everybody is physically expected to be in Vienna. The idea is to dive deep into the coding world where they'll be able to show you different opportunities in the coding world. And at the end of the day, you will be able to see if this is really what you want to change your career into if you are thinking of switching career. And if at the end of the day, you'll be able to make a decision and they themselves will be able to use that opportunity to be able to evaluate you. And I also need to mention that they have scholarship opportunity available for, you know, selected or very few scholarship opportunities available. So you can also look into their scholarship opportunity that will also be able to cater for your living expenses. But you cannot, I mean, according to them, they said they do not guarantee that you get scholarship, but scholarship are available. So you can look into that now. Back to the third phase. Now, the pacing phase where you will be physically present in, in Vienna by July is for four weeks and it starts in July. Now, let's quickly look at the details about, about this. Now, the uh, pacing phase, they have two, uh, two dates for when you can you know, go for the pacing phase. But I will, I, will, I, will, um, I will suggest for international applicants that they should focus on the 8th of July to 2nd of August uh, uh, four weeks training. The reason is because you will need visa to be able to go 
to uh, Vienna for uh, this training. So, which means after the four weeks of training, if you are lucky, if they, if you are, if you are selected to join the cohort by September second, see, if because the program starts fully by September second in their campus in Vienna. So, if you are, if you are lucky to be selected, that means the 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 from by second of August. So, which means by middle of August, you would have known your fate whether you will be selected or not. And you cannot decide to either, you know, go back to your country or, of course, find other plans for yourself in Vienna. So that is why I will strongly suggest this phase of the PCN, the second phase, the, the second phase of the PCN, which is the date, 8th of July, the one that starts by 8th of July to 2nd of August. That is the one I will really suggest for uh, international applicants so that at least you will not waste too much money and at the end of the day after the four weeks of training you will be able to see that oh is, is this really meant for me or is this something that i don't i can't i don't have the capacity or the ability to be able to uh, see through so and given that the training starts fully by 2nd of september which is very close to um i mean which i mean august is just some days or weeks in in, in between for you to be able to make decision or know your fate about the program and like i said no tuition fee no application fee is required no qualification is required and at least the only minimum then and there's no age restriction only that you must at least be 18 years um, above now that is that about the three phases of the application procedure okay now and let's let's also check some of the uh, 42 the 42 experience they, they will teach you what is called uh, gamification you learn about peer learning peer evaluation where uh, you you guys will be able to critique yourself you know provide feedback to your colleague your colleague will be able to provide feedback for you and then project based learning in real life project based issues is uh, are things that you guys will be learning with what is currently happening in organization and what you guys will be learning together uh, individual part and time frame, real world skills. These are the things that they will be training you on. And then, like I said, the program, this is the curriculum timeline. It's, it's expected to last 12 to 18 months. And then after that, first paid internship, test your skills and your programming knowledge in the real world. So they will assign you to an organization or what's, what some of their partner organization for you to go and intern with. And of course, it's a paid internship and after that you will also have another 18 month of mastery of the projects that you have acquired and like from what they said and according to the alumnus uh the most during uh during the internship opportunity most of their uh, uh, uh most of their students usually get their first paid job 80 percent of them usually get their first paid job during their paid internship at the organization that they assigned them to and the final internship is six months where they will also assign you to another company where you'll be able to also harness or own your skills in any choosing area of the IT related skill that you have acquired during that 12 to 18 months with the 42 Vienna. Now, that is that. And this is their partners. This is their industry partner. They have KPMG. They have I mean, uh, access to security, foreigners, life sec, you know, this is their uh, industry partners that they work with across uh, the 31 countries and the 54 campuses where they are in, they are in operations in Europe, okay? Now, this is the application procedure, of course, uh, like at the first phase, fill out your details and confirm your email, play the two games, you need a computer to complete this step, we do not recommend doing it on mobile. Meet us in one of our introduction meeting. Yeah, introduction meeting, like the introduction meeting of one hour, like I said, you meet them in the, in the introduction meeting where you guys will be able to get to know each other. They'll be able to introduce themselves, the course, the curriculum, the expectations, and every other thing about the course. Then the third phase, which is the pacing phase, which I like I suggest, I suggest that you guys go for the July uh, uh, pacing that end by uh, August 2nd. So that way you'll be able to, and they also provide uh, once you've been able to select, once you are selected for the PCN, they provide what is called like a letter for you that you will be able to take to the embassy of your country or to the Austrian embassy of your country to, for you to be able to apply for visa application. So 
I'll be showing to you. Uh, I mean, th th this. I, I, I mean, that is the that is the um, information that I gathered from their um, um, wh wh when I sent an email to them that okay, what if I need visa coming into your country? What do I, so they said that uh, you just send an email once you've been able to once you are selected for the percent stage, just send an email to so 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 and so. I mean, to what you are seeing on the screen, and then they'll be able to send you a letter that you will need to take to the embassy. And of course, you know that you will need your international passport. You will need to have a proof of fund. And if you are if you are in Nigeria, at least a max five million in your account for a single man is more than enough. And I mean, the European value at least about two thousand euro or one thousand five hundred euro in your account for living expenses is more than enough. And that with the letter, the uh, international passport. And your proof of funds, that is all that you need to take to the embassy to apply for visa. And by July of this year, you will be in uh, Vienna. And this is another opportunity that I just don't want you guys to miss this opportunity, especially if you have, if you have been thinking about the tech space. This is a great opportunity for you that you guys can latch into. And I'm really, really uh, very happy to have brought this information on your way. So, if you are just seeing our channel, like and subscribe to this channel so that by the time we bring opportunities and informations like this, you will be the first person to get notification. I titled this kind of opportunity, Easy Visa. And I think this is the fourth or fifth Easy Visa opportunity that I brought away uh, this year. So, and more and more of them are coming. So you cannot afford not to be notified when we drop this kind of information. Thank you very, very much once again. Bye-bye for now.